Aloha, I was accused I overly complicated the BIOS update procedure for HP Compact EC 7800 USDT. And that video is the worst video ever. Let's find out if that video it is the worst video ever and I overly complicated or not. This is the HP Compact EC 7800 USDT PC, like it showing in the boot window and in the BIOS. This is the smallest PC, from the Compact EC 7800 family. There are two bigger models out, the small form factor and the convertible minute hour. The user leaved a link, with a very simple method on how you should update the BIOS. So I will read that post. All you need is a USB flash drive formatted with the FAT32 file system. Download the latest BIOS update and run it. You should get an instruction page. On that page, you want to select the F10 flash system ROM option and you should see a view contents of DOS flash folder. Copy all of the files in that folder to your USB flash drive. Plug the flash drive in the USB port. Reboot the PC and at the beginning of the HP welcome screen, tap the F10 key to access the BIOS. There will be a menu to flash system ROM. Select that and it should see the BIOS update files on the USB flash drive. Then follow the on-screen instructions to proceed with updating the BIOS. I will try recreate this situation. I copied in the root of the USB drive the content of DOS flash folder and also the DOS flash folder too, and I burned a CD with the DOS flash folder content and the DOS flash folder in the root of the CD. I plug in the USB drive and power up the PC. I enter in the BIOS by pressing the F10 key. I select the English and press enter. I go to the flash system ROM menu. Select the USB drive and hit the F10 accept key. And appears the error page with the message, file is missing or damaged. Press any key to continue. Now I try again. I reboot the PC by pressing the Ctrl plus Alt plus Del keys and try again. I enter in the BIOS, select the English language. I go again to the flash system ROM menu, select the USB drive and hit the F10 accept key. I get again the error page with the message, file is missing or damaged. Press any key to continue. The BIOS file are on the flash drive, I copied in the root of the drive. I removed the USB drive and I inserted the CD with the BIOS files. I restart the PC and enter in the BIOS. I go again to the flash system ROM menu, select the CD-ROM drive and hit the F10 accept key. And I get again the error page with the message, file is missing or damaged. Press any key to continue. Now I restart the PC and I will try to boot from the CD-ROM, because I burned the CD as a bootable CD. By pressing the F9 key, I enter in the boot menu. I select the CD-ROM and press the enter key. The PC is booting from the CD-ROM. With the D command, I verify the content of the CD, but it shows only the Windows 98 boot files. I verify with the C command, the content of the C drive. The C is the MS RAM drive. I'm looking forward in the D drive. The D drive is the CD-ROM drive. I try to launch the flashbin.x, but it doesn't works. I go to the D drive with D colon backslash command. I launch flashbin. The flashbin.x identifies the system version and the upgrade version. The upgrade file is the same because I updated earlier. But for sake of the video I will update again. I press Y to upgrade. I press Y again. The microcode update module has been successfully reprogrammed. I can reboot the PC. Let me know if the how to update BIOS for HP Compact EC 7800 USDT was really the worst video you ever seen.
if somebody has succeeded using the method described in that post. Please leave a message in the comments how did you did it. That method works with the new PC, but it doesn't works with old PC. Please share, subscribe and give me a like if you like it, if you don't like it comment what didn't like it. See you in the next video, when I will try to upgrade this PC with a quad core CPU. Again.